Hey guys, this is Fixer Mad, and in today's video, I'm going to be doing a nice quick tutorial on how to install a progress bar onto the latest version of Anki, which at the time of recording this video is Anki 23. Now, a lot of you may be aware the progress bar add ons have been broken for quite a while now on Anki 23, but thankfully, when I was searching for a new progress bar add on, I was able to find this add-on by Mr. Shige Yuki. This will work on Anki 23, and I'm gonna pull up the old progress bar so I can show you how it looks. It's gonna be a progress bar that basically showcases how much progress you've done on your cards, either through reviews, new cards, etc. You can put it in the top or the bottom location, but I usually like leaving it in the top. The progress bar I've had was actually broken as well. A lot of people have been inquiring and asking me, hey, how do you get a progress bar to show up on your Anki? I just had it as a remnant of Anki 2.1, but thankfully now I can show you guys how to get a proper functioning progress bar for Anki 23. So let's go ahead and get this tutorial started. Go to the Anki web webpage for progress bar, the fork for Anki 23. I'll have this link in the description, not this one. But yeah, just copy this into your web browser and you can copy the download code from here. And the instructions will also have the download code down here as well under the download section. Really not that much detailed instructions yet. Just refer back to the original pages if you want more detailed instructions on how this add-on works. But I'll be uh, doing a pretty comprehensive rundown right now. So open up your Anki, go to tools, add-ons, hit get add-ons, copy the code in, hit okay, installed successfully, go ahead and restart on key. If you guys, this is not a default setting, by the way, this is also powered by an add-on called Anki Restart. I did a video on that, so if you guys wanna check that out, it's on my channel. So just restart on key. Anki has been restarted. Go to Tools, Add-ons, Progress Bar. You can go ahead and check the settings you want to activate for the Progress Bar. So I like setting the show number and show percent to true since I do like seeking the progress I'm making on my Anki reviews. And then I hit OK. And I believe I do not have to restart it for this progress to show. I've done some reviews already today. My default settings are set to 20 reviews a day just because it's a test profile. But if I go here, I can add more reviews. So I'm just going to add like 11 quick reviews. Blood volume contained in arteries is called the stress volume. This is the fifth cycle of cardiac hmm. ventricular filling, reduced filling. Okay. So I got that wrong. So I'm going to hit again, increase venous tone. Increase mean pressure, pretty straightforward. That's three gallop, didn't know that. It's been a while since I've done cardio, so cardiac output to decrease, decrease, yep. Aortic regurgitation murmurs, apex mitral area, or left sternal border, okay. First aortic arch. And the trimetral, okay. It's the bedule. And while I'm doing this, you can see the uh, progress is changing every time I get a question right. So that's really cool. Right sided. So now I know reduced filling. Intensity of right. S3 gallop. Uh, herbs point, left upper sternal border or left sternal border, mitral, systolic. As you can see, as I'm doing the reviews, it changes. And when I go to decks, I have seven more cards left since I did three reviews before this video to test the add-on. And I did 10 reviews, so I have 10, seven more left. Very cool add-on. Actually, I think I did two, and then I did 11 now. But for the most part, it should track your cards accurately and will give you a good estimate of how much progress you have left. And 
I know a lot of you guys also like the old progress bar I had where it showed how many you hit again, good, easy, etc., and the uh, true retention rate and everything. I think if I can get a hold of the code, I can modify it a little bit to get those to show up as well. I'll be working on that in my spare time alongside some Anki Tagger stuff that people have been having trouble with. So stay tuned for that, guys. Um, I hope this tutorial was helpful for you. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns on how this works, please let me know in the comment section below. And if you like this video, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already for more content like this in the future. Anyways, this is Fixer Med signing off. I hope you guys have a good day. Good luck studying and goodbye, everyone.